look outside, we see the sun trying to get through, mm -hmm. but the sun's been having trouble peeking through the clouds, but it's not having trouble getting that warmth to us because yesterday we, we felt it, right? It was like upper 70s in many places across SoCal. It was really, really nice. And today we'll be in low 70s, still under much of those clouds. Looking over at Disneyland, you can see the temperatures about 53 degrees. A little warm up later today. It'll be a good day to head out to the park and good day to head out to the beach. Long Beach, 57 degrees as well. And then when we look at our map, Ventura County now under those clouds as well. So all of our region here is uh, dealing with some cloudy conditions. 42 in Palmdale, Big Bear 32 degrees, Palm Springs 56, Temecula 50, Anaheim 55, downtown 54 degrees, 51 in Burbank and Santa Monica 54 degrees. All right, well, we just still have that high pressure there. It's not as strong as it was yesterday. So our temperatures are still gonna be relatively warm, not as warm as yesterday. We do have those clouds that are just uh, funneling in from this low pressure system that's spinning out here over the Pacific. That's eventually gonna get closer to us, but as it gets closer and closer, it weakens in strength and there's not that much moisture available, so we're not going to get much rain out of it. Watch here from the computer model showing the cloud coverage throughout today. That continues into tomorrow morning. This is 7 o'clock. And then we fast forward to Monday evening and maybe some showers start to develop. It's going to be just scattered. It's going to be isolated and not a lot of rain. Maybe hundredths of an inch to a quarter of an inch possible. Some people might not see any, maybe just a trace of rain. As you can see going into Tuesday, it is uh, all over the place and just not much uh, held together. Tuesday at 11 o'clock, there's some clearing and some sunshine Tuesday afternoon. That'll last into Wednesday into Thursday. You see here on that 70 forecast, still above average today, but then tomorrow the showers come in possibly in the afternoon, evening hours, Tuesday morning, the sun comes out in the afternoon hours, Wednesday, Thursday, we're up right at average on Wednesday. So these two days are actually gonna be pretty nice. Friday, we have some clouds moving on in, temperatures come down, and then Saturday, it looks like we have another system coming our way. Now this system on Saturday, it's a colder system, not much rain available, but because it's so cold, this looks like it's going to be a big snow event and the snow levels are going to drop to levels that we probably haven't seen so far this winter. Valleys Inland Empire temperatures dipping to the mid 60s tomorrow. Cloudy, cool for the most part. Showers possibly overnight into Tuesday, Tuesday morning, then the afternoon sunshine and that lasts a couple of days before the clouds start to roll in for the next system coming on Saturday with a 40% chance. Beach communities, we see surf at two to four feet today and tomorrow, temperatures in the mid 60s for a couple days, then low 60s as that next system starts to move on through mountain areas. Okay, the current system that's gonna arrive tomorrow into Tuesday. If there is snow, maybe an inch or two in our mountain areas, so Monday night into Tuesday morning, snow levels go from 7,500 feet to 6,500 feet, couple days of sunshine, and then Saturday, Saturday into Sunday, it looks like the snow levels could drop to maybe 2,500 feet. Like I said, it's a very cold system that's coming on through. And so therefore, we could see our passes affected by this storm. We haven't seen it go that low yet. Desert spots, you see the temperatures going to the low 60s with a 20 to 30% chance of showers Monday night into Tuesday morning, sunshine, and then the next system moving on through with temperatures coming down to the mid 50s. So Mark, Irene, it's gonna be really interesting watching that next storm next weekend and the snow levels coming down pretty low. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.